Oh, right here, right here, right here. Look at this, right behind the boat. This is amazing. Oh, I'm getting hit, I'm getting hit. Come on, there's one, yes, yes, baby. But I'm just gonna throw him right here because these fish are going nuts, absolutely nuts right here. All around us, on the John boat, what a freaking day, finally. Oh, this is what, this is the action that John boat has deserved. And I've just been neglecting it. I'm sorry, John boat. I'm so sorry. Check out that catfish. Are you freaking oh, yeah. Yeah. What is going on guys and welcome back to another fishing adventure. So I got the John boat behind the truck and we're heading out to the lake. I've had the John boat for a while now and I have yet to catch a fish on it. So today is the day. Uh, I know for a fact we're gonna catch them because the sand bass are running, chasing the shad, and we have the live scope. If we can't catch the fish today with the live scope while the shad and sand bass are running, uh, we probably shouldn't be semi-professional fishermen. I, I don't think I'm a semi-professional fisherman, but I am sponsored by Okuma. What, what? Shout out to Okuma for uh, always helping out the channel and sponsoring me and giving me awesome, amazing fishing gear. If you guys want to go check them out, go check out okumafishingusa.com. Link is in the description. They sponsor the channel, and I really don't sponsor or shout them out enough, I feel like, for uh, all they do for me. So, uh, shout out to Okuma and Fish Lab Tackle and SoftStillUSA.com. So, uh, we got the drop boat back there. We're going to head out there. My buddy Dave, he's out there. He just sent me a picture of like seven fish on the dock. And what that means is the sand bass were blowing up, and he didn't have time to put the fish on a stringer. He just threw them on the dock and got back out there to catch more. So they literally just blew up as I'm driving down to the lake. Hopefully they will blow up again while I'm down there. But uh, it's just gonna be an awesome chill day on the John boat catching some sand bass. I'm excited. So let's head down there and hopefully go catch the very first fish on the John boat. All right, guys, here is a John boat. I see Dave out there on the end of this dock here and he is over there in his fishing stance. If I see him catch one, I may just have to run over there with a rod. Dave has a very uh, particular stance whenever he's on some fish. So I can tell <laughs> when he's on fish from a distance. Let's go ahead and drop the boat in real quick. Oh baby, the John boat. Everyone's favorite boat. It's my favorite boat too. Don't get me wrong, I love this boat. I wanted to do a catch and cook today, but it is kind of windy. Watch out ducks. There we are. Now she's warm somewhat. Freaking love this boat, man. I get why everyone else loves it too. I get it. I get it. They just came up right when you came down the dock. It came up right there. I know. I saw you in your fishing stand, so I was like, "Yes, they're on." Yeah. But uh, I didn't. Yeah, see you pulling your thing my, in. My fishing stand. Yeah, do it again. <laughs> Show them your fishing stand. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> All right, sweet. I'm gonna yeah, go park the truck, and then I guess we'll wait for them yeah, to blow up windy. again. I think the wind will help us out. Good. All right, today's goal catch the very first fish on the John boat and then second goal is to cook it up which that will be in the next video but we are going to be cooking up a fish today yeah buddy let's go officially break in the John boat I'll yell at you if I see him let's get this live scope plugged in all right we got power a little dusty let's uh dust off the live scope hasn't been used in a while yeah buddy yeah buddy guys i am about to head down to arizona and go to the grand canyon with my sister so uh we will do that in two days i will be filming it make a video out of it just because it's a cool big trip with my sister I want to have it on video keep the memories alive you know so that will be in two days so I will have a video that isn't fishing it will be traveling we may cross some water I don't know I will bring a rod a travel rod just in case of course we're gonna start off with the spoon with this wind I bet they're over on that bank over there because all the water is going this way so I bet they are over there. I'm gonna go over there. 
It's like I'm running right through them, but there is a massive, oh my God. That is the biggest ball of bait I've ever seen in my life. That was probably a million shad right there. I'm not even kidding. That was insane. I need to be following that ball of bait around from a distance though. I just ran right over him. Let's, let's just make a few casts through it. There's got to be something following that. Checking it out. Come on, Sam Bass, wake up. Start chasing these shad. And I'll be out here all day until it happens. We got to catch a freaking fish on this John boat. It's happening today, dang it. Uh, it's been slow so far. I haven't really seen much on the fish. Ooh, ooh, hold up. We got some action under the docks, looks like. All right, boys, they just all blew up right here and we were right by it. We got so lucky. We need to capitalize though. We need to get, we need to stay on these fish. Uh, there they are, I see them on the live scope. Let's go, baby. They're already gone. Holy crap, they're so fast, dude. I can't even see them on the freaking live scope anymore. Ah, oh, almost had the first fish. Shad boil. Oh my god, they're over there. Are you freaking kidding me? They're so freaking fast, dude. They're going off, they're going off. We gotta go. I almost, almost hopped onto the dock, but then I was like, no. Today's goal is to catch one on the John boat, not on the freaking dock. So we gotta drive around the dock and go get these freaking sand. Oh, they're still going, they're still going. Come on, baby. They're right around this dock. It's a race. We're racing. We're racing. There they are. I'm gonna cast. Come on, wind. Mate, give me a good cast. Oh, oh, come on. I think I'm right on top of them. Oh, I hit one. Come on. Come on, baby. Give me my first freaking sand bath or fish on the John boat today. Oh, my Lanta. Dude, I can see the freaking, that big old school of shad. That I saw earlier, it is so thick of sand bass. It's like a black spot over here. It's, it, it is nuts. No way I missed it again, bro. I'm so pissed. Ah, they're here. They're still here. Let's make a cast, a long one, as if they're still here. Because they are, they have to be. There's no way they're not. Yes, baby, there's one. We are recording our first fish on the John boat. Let's land it. Let's land it. Yes. <laughs> our first fish. You know what, since uh, this is our first fish, I do plan to do a catch and cook today. So, since this is our first ever John boat, fish i'm gonna let this guy go because i i believe it's gonna be good luck for the john boat our first fish ever on the john boat baby let's go and we're gonna we we're gonna release them we do want to do a catch and cook today but since he's our first ever john boat fish we're gonna let him go i need to reorientate the boat this wind is nuts guys it is not helping the cause for the john boat Honestly, if I knew it was this bad, I probably wouldn't be out here. It, the waves aren't bad, it's just the wind. It's really hard to control. There's all that bait right here. I bet that's where all the freaking sand bass are too. They're not blowing them up though. Not yet anyways. All right, so we got the first fish of the Jumbo. The Jumbo is officially broken in. It's official. It is official that Jumbo catches fish. Let's go, baby but we need to catch way more. That was just the first one. There's just a black dot on the lake and it is just, oh, look at that. I caught a freaking shad. That's how many freaking shad are over there. I caught one on the spoon. Just again, guys, these uh, sand bass are chasing the shad and that is how much the shad resembles my spoon. Which is why these sand bass just freaking attack the spoon. Oh, I wish I had spot lock. This would be a whole lot easier. This wind is stupid. This current is stupid. 
Hopefully we didn't just throw back the only fish we're gonna catch today because I do want to do a catch and cook today as well. Maybe, I mean, it's windy. It might be too windy for a catch and cook today, but uh, we'll see what happens. Oh, there's another ball of bait over there. There's two huge balls of bait. I think this strong wind is like holding them all together. They're trying to stay close together today. We are uh, about to run over one. Freaking huge, man. It just, it makes a huge C. Oh, right there, right there. Oh no, no, no. Make sure the troll motor's good. Damn it. See that? That was a two second blow up. How am I supposed to even keep up with that, dude? They're still there. They have to be. Come on, fish. Come on. Just, just work with me here. Work with me here. Something had to scare those shad to boil like that. Guys, I am just, I'm balls deep in this uh, ball of shad. They don't care today. I'm right over top of them. They're just surrounding the front of the boat right here. But I saw a huge boil over here. Come on, baby. It is crazy how much freaking shad. Oh, right there. Right there in front of us. We're literally right there in front of us. Come on, baby. Don't stop. Don't stop. Oh, right here, right here, right here. Look at this. Right behind the boat. This is amazing. Oh, I'm getting hit. I'm getting hit. Come on. There's one. Yes. Yes, baby. Right behind the freaking boat. Oh, this guy's a freaking fighter. Holy crap. They're, these fish are going nuts, dude. All right, there is the first fish. We will keep this guy kind of snagged in the gill. I'm not sure what that's about. But I'm just gonna throw him right here because these fish are going nuts. Absolutely nuts right here. All around us on the John boat. What a freaking day, finally. Oh, this is what, this is the action that John boat has deserved. And I've just been neglecting it. I'm sorry, John boat. I'm so sorry. I'm also sorry to the viewers because you guys have been asking for this for the longest time. Well guys, it has finally, it is happening. I'm keeping this guy. I'm not going to try to be too careful because we got to get back out there. There's two. I'm just throwing these guys in the floor. Uh, they're all by the bank. They're everywhere. What am I talking about? They're everywhere right now. Holy crap. Oh, they are all around us. These guys. Oh my God, they're blowing up. Is that one? Oh, the shad are going crazy. What's happening? Do I have one? I do, I have one. I couldn't even tell this guy was not fighting. Dave! Dave! They're going nuts, come here! Gotta tell my buddy Dave to get over here. Oh, we're about to hit the freaking dock. We're going backwards. I'll probably just keep two of these guys today and give the rest to Dave. Like I said, I only want two, but uh, I wanna catch as much as I can. Dave is running over here. Oh my gosh, dude, that was so freaking exciting. I almost couldn't speak. They are, they're, they kind of, oh, there's one. They didn't stop. They're still there. Everywhere. Dave's running over here. Cash shallow. We got four in the boat, baby. Killing it. They're everywhere, man. Dude, they were blowing up all around me. It was insane. It was amazing. 
There's one. Back to back action. Dave's on. Let's go, baby. Let's go. <laughs> this is insane. Oh, I love it. I freaking love it. It was a kind of a slow start, man. I went like 20 minutes, 30 minutes without any fish. And then they just started blowing up everywhere around me. I've never seen that before. Ever. Another one in the boat, baby. I got to control the boat still. They are freaking stacked up. Just absolutely. It's been cast after cast. I got to make sure my freaking GoPro is going still. Yep, sure is. They're right here blowing up in front of me. Uh, oh my gosh. Guys, look at the. They're just everywhere. They're freaking everywhere. There's no time to even look at the live scope right now. We don't have to. We can see them. We can see them, baby. All right. Dave's on. They're still shallow. What a freaking day, man. Ah. Oh. On the John boat too, guys. This, this is what y'all wanted. I hope y'all are happy. I'm happy. I'm having a freaking blast on the John boat. I love it, even in this wind. Oh, me and Dave may have just crossed. You're good. Caught Dave. Look what Dave is using. Same thing as me. Just a little bit bigger. That's Dave's spoon. There you go, Dave. Sorry, fish. Sorry, buddy. It's, I don't have a live well for you. Oh, there's one. There's one. Ugh. Once again, guys, this video is sponsored by Okuma Fishing. I have been using their Psycho 6. For the past two years now and they are absolutely amazing they're my go-to rods and reels the uh, psycho stick and the hakai baitcaster reel that is the my favorite combo in the world right now uh, right now i'm just throwing spoons so i have them on a uh, spinning reel but this is a okuma epixer amazing smooth reel this is the xt20 size it is perfect for catching these sand bass like you're seeing right now they are blowing up everywhere right now but yeah guys go check out okumafishingusa.com okuma psycho stick i promise you you will not regret your decision they are a price oh, i got one oh, i got a bit they are a pricey rod because they are part of okuma's premium bass rod series so they are a high quality rod but uh guys worth every penny i promise you they're right here Go check them out, guys. The link is in the description. Uh, once again, Okuma Psycho Sticks. Amazing rods. They're for bass. I'm using them for sand bass. I use them for everything. That was not a far enough cast. What am I doing? I have a problem with uh, not casting past the fish, but like at the fish. And it kind of screws me sometimes. Let's freaking go, baby. This is amazing. We're having an awesome day. You even got Dave on some. I could, I could have kept this to myself, but I didn't. I'm nice. I wanted Dave to catch him. So far, we got one, two, three, four, five, six in the boat. Again, I will be uh, giving some of these to Dave. Because uh, I only want to clean two. I am cleaning these fish on the boat today, so I don't want a massive amount of fish on the boat. Oh, I just got bit. Come on. Dave! I'm gonna give you some of these fish. All right, I'm giving these guys my extra fish. More? That's it. I'm gonna keep the other two. I got six total. Said I got eight the first time. Did you? Yeah. Dude, right. I wish you were over here. <laughs> was, it, was it huge? It was yeah. crazy, bro. It was everywhere. Every direction I looked, I saw them blowing up. Are you taking off or what? No, I just, I want these fish to get back in the water so they're not suffering too much. They're gonna be suffering in my belly. Hey, buddy, that's my nose. You can still be nice to him, you know. All right. You wanna pet him or something? You wanna give him a kiss? Bye, babies. Oh. I love you. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>